The enchanting landscape here in southern Arizona is unique in the world. We all know and love the beauty of the Sonoran Desert and our iconic saguaro cactus, but not all of us realize what an amazing diversity of plant and animal life exists all around us thanks to our sky islands. The sky islands are the mountains that rise above our desert basins, just like islands in the ocean rise above the water. The mountains enable different layers of plants and animals, layers called life zones, that occur because of the different climates at different elevations. As you go up our beautiful sky islands, the temperatures cool and the annual rainfall increases. The plants and animals change as the elevation rises all the way to the pine forests at the top. This captivating Sky Islands region spans from southern Arizona to northern Mexico, and it is also called the Madrean Archipelago. An archipelago is a cluster of islands, and ours are mountain islands that rise above a desert or grassland sea. And the word Madrean refers to the Sierra Madre Mountains of northern Mexico that anchor the southern end of the region. The Sky Island Alliance is a nonprofit organization dedicated to preserving the natural ecosystems in this unique Sky Island region. In May 2012, the Sky Island Alliance, in collaboration with many other groups from both the United States and Mexico, organized a conference to bring together all the scientists, agencies, and land managers who work passionately to preserve the amazing biodiversity and habitats of the Madrean Archipelago. Cecil Schwabe from the U.S. Geological Survey was one of the conference organizers. It's, I think, one of the most important regional uh, meetings that we have. We have over 300 people attending. We had 190 presentations. So this is by far the biggest conference as far as information delivered that we've yet had. It's a nice diverse group of folks, both where everybody's from, as well as agencies and nonprofits and different researchers from many, many different universities in both the U.S. and in Mexico. The one important and unique element for the Madrian Archipelago is that it constitutes a biogeographic unit that crosses from the U.S. to Mexico, from Mexico to the U.S. To me, it is a, a symbol of collaboration between the two countries. That makes it really very interesting. This is the first time in these Madrean Archipelago conferences that we've had simultaneous translations in English and Spanish, and we're trying to increase the participation in scientists and, and managers from Mexico. We actually had scholarships for many of the Mexican students to come up and present their information. For me, the Sky Islands are a really special part of Southern Arizona. They're, they really are like oases in the desert for uh, not just a whole host of plants and animals that are fascinating in their own right, but for people as well. I can tell my kids are fascinated by knowing that there's, you know, there's jaguars and mountain lions out there, and, and it's a really, it really makes this place very special. The Madrean Archipelago Conference shows how many passionate people are working to preserve and restore the wonders of this biogeographic region. Those of us who live in southern Arizona are lucky to live among the Sky Islands, and we hope that our children and their children after them will be able to enjoy the diverse beauty of this amazing natural resource. You can learn more about our Sky Islands at the upcoming exhibit, Exploring Sky Islands that opens at the Flandreau Science Center in August 2012. You can also join in the educational programs and citizen science activities organized by the Sky Island Alliance by going to skyislandalliance.org. We'll see you in the islands.